What's up, everybody? AG here, and today I have done it. I have played League of Legends after taking a break for quite some time, and the game feels the same, even though I know I've missed two patches. I've missed 11 and 12. I'm just now coming into 12. Not even sure when the patch came out, but I decided that I haven't played League in a while. I want to play it, so I got some of my old friends that I play with all the time in League of Legends and always do stuff with in League, and we just played, and it was fun, and I enjoyed it. I still like League of Legends, but I only really like it with friends now. I'm not trying to be super competitive. I know I wanted to hit Diamond, but I'm not so excited about hitting Diamond anymore. I, I want to be good at other games and at the end of the day I still like League of Legends I like to play it and I feel like I could still do commentaries and still play the game but today I definitely took a look at Zyra and I feel like she's actually pretty strong still and a lot stronger than she was before post the mage major update that they had where all of the mages do all of these really crazy things now where Syndra is able to throw multiple balls at the same time Zyra's just it I feel like she's disgusting now and I heard alawi has been changed and a lot different I know that Lucian's no longer a prominent AD carry anymore and people are playing other things now and just a lot have changed in League of Legends since last I've played it and it feels it still feels like the same game it feels like what I'm used to you go in there you make things happen and I know through a lot of derpy gameplay that you're gonna see today that it's it's still interesting what happens and the enemy Caitlyn raged out early because she had a support team Owen thought he was trolling so she started trolling the entire enemy team and it was just a huge mess and so people are still getting upset at the game and it's just a huge time investment and it was like a 30 something minute game probably a 40 something minute game and we just went through it and it just it felt fun for me because i was doing really well but um, i assume if i was losing it would feel like agonizing hell but at the end of the day i i would still enjoy the game i just sat through it i was like didn't do too well early game late game kind of dumpstered them absolutely there was even a time where i was just kind of like waltz down mid didn't even know what i was doing and i just kind of died for no reason didn't even need to die but at the end of the day i still like league of legends i'm still thinking of things that i want to do for league of legends i'm still going to be doing the every x player be like series so expect a video like that on monday i'm actually thinking about streaming again i just got done setting up my stream yesterday and it was tons of fun had some people come out had about 20 people come out to watch me play some overwatch which is really interesting but i just feel that i want to get back into streaming it's fun for me i enjoy it and i want to do it more and a game that i feel that i could stream and be entertaining and interactive with people is definitely overwatch at the moment especially with the setup that i have going on currently i feel like that is more than possible if you guys want to see me stream sometime go ahead and hit up that twitch.tv slash ag and you'll be able to hang out with me and interact with me in live time while I'm just hanging out and playing video games and if you guys are on my discord i will definitely be sure to let you guys know immediately when i am streaming on that day in the announcement section so go ahead and join my discord as well there will be a link for that in the description below going on from that talking more about Zyra I feel that yes she is definitely still tons of fun for me to play I will always love Zyra in League of Legends until they completely just even if they made her useless I think I'd still enjoy playing her and I feel that Zyra is just even more broken than what she was before so it's definitely interesting to see more Zyra's being played but it's definitely fun for me to be able to play Zyra and still enjoy it even though I, I make a lot of mistakes I miss a lot of things I miss a lot of plants I'm not as good as I used to be about a month ago but I'm definitely still happy with my ability to play the game I'm not probably gonna stay in platinum I'm probably gonna let it decay because at the end of the day I just I just do not want to spend a whole lot of time being so emotionally invested in the game because I know that it it's very upsetting and time consuming sometimes when it comes to rank and at this point I just enjoy playing the game with my friends and it's what I enjoy to do so I want to continue enjoying the game I don't want to feel obligated to be some person that you look to for professional advice on playing the game or sitting down and telling you exactly what you should be doing on every single character in the game but I feel like I can definitely at least just talk and play the game and have some decent background footage going on while talking about whatever it is I may even talk about random stuff going on in my life I may talk about random stuff going on in games things that I've across as far as situations like today with this Caitlyn that was completely toxic and decided to troll by going mid which was completely rude and I just don't feel like that's necessary in a game regardless of how long the game is if you're there and you're stuck there and it's gonna be awful you don't have to try and ruin that for people you can do what you can to try and make the game good because if that Caitlyn would have just let things happen the way they were our ADC was shut down and our top laner wasn't doing too well and we could have just easily lost to that but because the enemy Caitlyn just wanted to troll and flame the whole time it just made it 
easier for us to focus on beating them. So sitting down and just making things happen the way they should is definitely good for us and shows that we had really good consistency with doing well and it just shows you that toxic playing just doesn't help you win games. Which I really don't think people should focus on being toxic in video games because it just makes no sense. It's like saying, hey, I just want to ruin your day because you're bad at the game and I'm better than you so I'm just going to talk down on you the whole time because well, there's no way we're winning this game because I can't carry you. And when you look at the statistics, when you look at everything they've done and the person that they're talking about it, in actuality, if that person would have just been quiet and let the other person carry them and just tried their best to focus on winning the game, then they'd probably come back from the situation they were in. But people just don't think about that because we have different age groups we have different backgrounds we have different types of personalities of people all playing these different competitive video games and then some people get very upset and some people just they just don't care and they go off on people for no reason and then it upsets other people because they can't handle that especially if they're doing well and somebody was like hey you're trash kill yourself and you know some people just don't handle that the same way as others but what i really want to do is encourage people like if you're losing a game just try to be nice just don't blame it on anybody else just try to see what you can do better and i know sometimes that's really hard to do especially if you've done everything you know you can do to your ability however i really feel that if you are able to take a step back from that mentality of you've done the best you can and say that i could have done better then you can actually try to start learning something when it comes to any video game you play not just league of legends not just overwatch not just hello kitty adventure not club penguin if you just take a step back and really think about what you're doing then you can obviously you can honestly go somewhere with whatever it is you want to do and i honestly believe that and go ahead in the comments below leave a message letting me know what you think and feel about what it is i had to say today and i would love to hear from you guys because i always do and of course thank you so much as always for watching and i will see you guys in the next video that i decide to do which will definitely be an every x player be like video for League of Legends. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Alright, peace.